Well, it's a funny thing that, uh, this is not just about Super 8, just in, in general. The monster is almost like secrets that people don't really want to know the answer to. So for example, like, people will say, when I was working on Lost, people would say, so wait, what's that, what, what's the island, don't, don't tell me. Like they would literally tell me not to tell them the second they asked the question. And, and I think monsters, you want to see the monster, but at the same time, there's something wonderful about it being withheld and, and, and hidden and, and, and sort of just off camera. Um, you, you mentioned Alien and there's a shot uh, in one of the deleted scenes from, from Alien where Veronica Cartwright's character is being uh, attacked, killed by the alien. It's one of the scariest scenes in the film. But there's a shot that they didn't use that is this wide angle shot from way back in this corridor and you see Veronica Cartwright standing up in full frame, you see the alien stand up, and it's maybe the least scary thing you've ever seen in your life. And there's a reason they didn't use it, because the, the mm -hmm. creature is contained in the frame, it's small, you see the scale, you understand it. You all of a sudden have an understanding, even though it is a scary thing that's attacking this mm -hmm. character, cinematically it was not, it wasn't, it wasn't frightening. And when you watch the scene, it's terrifying. And it's all kind of how little you see. You know, and makes it, 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 it that shot became subjective, uh, became objective, and the whole scene is subjective. So to me, I tried to tell the story in Super 8 subjectively, and tried to avoid a God's eye sort of, you know, third-party points of view as much as possible.